everybody, this is Letty and this is a video response to Bonnie who is Sassy Scrappers and she had requested us to do a video of our messy craft room. I'm actually moving from my other craft room which was my two car garage to a smaller room inside the house so it's a very big challenge to move from a big room to a smaller one so I'm going to start on this corner and as you can see, it's I'm barely moving, and I started last week moving in here. So on this shelf, I'm going to try to put all my projects. And as you can see, there's still a lot of mess going on here. Rearranging everything. Nothing that's there is probably not going to be ending up being there. But I um, have stuff on the floor. This little cabinet. I have, uh, that one's already organized, and I need to label everything also. Um, this, I'm just going to put some of the jars, mason, jar, mason jars with some things in there. So I'm working on that. And then on this shelf over here, I have, let me see, I have my flowers and ribbon, and they're all like a, uh, color coordinated so I have my purple flowers and underneath is the tub will be the tub with my purple or lavender ribbon and so on blue red or burgundy the yellows the greens the whites and so on so I'll have my flowers and my ribbon and then underneath I have all my trims and I'm still organizing. I have that tub right there that I need to organize. And I'm just putting them, um, wrapping them on cardboard. And then I have on those little um, burlap sacks, I have my laces. And they all, they're they also by color. And I have two rows of those, the bags. And then inside the closet, I have... Up there I have some tubs and I also do some painting so I have all my paper on that one then right here I have my um, books for painting over here I just have different types of books and I think that's also that one's for painting then underneath, right here, I'm just going to put my ribbon hanging because I have like two to big tubs full of ribbon. So they're not going to fit on the, this other tubs. And this roll is all my scrapbook and card making magazines. Then I have more tubs right there with different craft supplies or items. That one still needs to be organized underneath. I have all my albums. That's just going to be a quick one because later on I think we need to show how we organized it. So more tubs right there. And then over here in front I have another shelf. And I just put some little plastic containers. They're going to have different items. Baskets jars and then these two um, plastic containers um, those are going to be those are all my stickers and they're by theme then um, let me open the other door and inside this Inside of this side, um, inside the closet, I also have more tubs up there. I have all my stencils hanging, and then that tub is with my paints. These are my beads and other stuff. And then inside this um, dresser, I have all my trims. Trims. It's full with trims. This one also has my, my, my sequins and then more trims. And it's in 
empty. I still have two empty ones to put more stuff in there. And on this side of my desk, I have one of those shoe organizers, and it's packed with um, different embellishments. More embellishments. And this is my desk. It's, right now it's so messy. All those things have to be put away somewhere. And I have another underneath. I have another little tub right there. My table. My table. And then I have a, a dress form where I put all my pens or other things that I'm, I crochet. Some scarves. And right here I'm working on two mini albums. I have my little, my scissors, my markers, more flowers to put away. And then over here, let me see if I can move to the front. These two um, shelves, they're units I have from the top. I have all those tubs, have flowers. And that needs to be organized. I'm working with my paper right here. Different things, tools, tags, fibers, my doilies, my Cricut. So everything there needs to still be organized. On this side over here I have all my fabrics. And then on the side, I have all my papers. Papers and then scrap, scraps of papers. By, and I have them by um, they're the paper pads, and some of them are the 12 by 12. The other ones are the 8 by 11. Then I, right here, I just I got this little dress for a dollar. I just put it there. It looks pretty. Then on the back of the door... I have those reeds with I wish I take out those these little um sprays and I use them for my crafts and then I have this with my inks on both sides and then I put these two shelves over here so I can organize my um punches. So I'm gonna take you outside just for a little bit so you guys can see what else I need to, needs to come in this room so let's go because my son is taking over the garage he has a, a band so he's gonna put all his guitars and everything in their drum set so this on this table I don't know if you can see it and underneath the table all that has to go in my craft room then I have another table over here full with stuff underneath boxes, albums, paper, all that has to go in there. I have this box full of um, boxes that need to be altered. And then on this side, also on the floor, I have more stuff. Two bags full of boxes to be altered. So all this, and I still have more stuff in the garage, but I'm not going to take you in there. There's a lot of yarn and the ribbon. I have two of those big tubs with stamps, rubber stamps, that I need to organize. So this is my messy room and everything that has to go in there. Um, hopefully, in a week or two, I'll have everything organized. So thanks for watching. Thanks, Bonnie, for the challenge. And hopefully I can fit most of it. I know I'm not going to be able to fit everything, but maybe just what I'm into right now, which is uh, altering things and paper crafting. So everybody have a great day, and thanks for watching, stopping by, and come join the challenge. Thank you. Bye.